And um, this one is whose? He just told oh, me, man. Oh, fine. Huh? F -I -N -E. Fine. We yes. just went over the Blueprints mic, and I just called the homeowner mm -hmm. this morning, and we went over some uh, just some questions that we had on it. So they're Big starting friend. that out today. Mm -hmm. And then this one over here. What's the name on that homeowner? Do you know? Hey, Dave. Jonathan. What house is this? Look. It's probably on that. Look on the. Let me tongue. look over here. It's brown. Oh, it's brown. Okay, got brown, it. Brown, yeah. Thank you. Well, we've got, I think, about 12 or 13 homes up here. Yep. Mm -hmm. And so that's why we're up here looking at them all. But mm -hmm. well, I want to walk through. They requested that all the trim or all the siding be screwed off. And we used to screw them all off, right? We used to put yeah. screws on everything. We went to nails because, as you can see, the screws visually sometimes can be unsightly just to look at but now why did they want screws instead i of think nails? they think it would hold hold better oh right okay, so they had a concern um, about and that's that. why we always went with screws but i just man it that's was a just lot a of uh, putty uh, putting in there in it to cover yeah. that now okay so then we put a, a um adhesive and then we put our batten strips over mm -hmm. these right okay. and you can see them down here now real quick do you do we know what size this trailer is or this yeah, house? eight by 18. 8 by 18, yeah, yeah. brown. Okay. Now, so here, so we put these strips, so there's adhesive behind here, and as you can see, this screw's on one side, this screw's on the other side, so we alternate all the way oh, up through okay, here. Oh, okay, I see. And that hopefully will keep that from twisting. Okay. Now, the reason we quit, we don't quit, we'll still do, still do wood on our customs, because we're still building custom homes on our schedule. Right. But if this home went to a massive dry climate, like Arizona mm -hmm. or Southern Cal or something like that, Nevada, this wood, because of our temperature and our mm -hmm. moisture content here, makes this stuff move. Okay. And that's why we said, hey, we can't warranty this wood anymore because we've had so many homes that we've had to go back and right. replace. I remember. Now, if they're built and left here in the eastern part of the United States or in the southern part, we're good. Now, do they never acclimate? It never or ever happens. You would have say to take never... this wood and set it in Arizona and let it acclimate before you installed it. Okay. All right. Now, my goodness. There's just, yeah, it's just uh, the moisture content has so made So we're going to have to start building out west. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's go today. Yeah. Okay. So now this one's going to have, I remember we designed this for the homeowner, and we and, and uh, I remember putting the two fixed pieces of glass here yeah. on the other side. Now what we had to do is, even though we can order it, there's still a discrepancy on the exact size. So what they did is they went ahead and framed it in, then they sent the sizes in, so okay. we know we got exactly what we need on, this, okay. on these, right? And you know, I am actually a uh, big proponent of fixed glass. I know a lot of people like a movable window, and I do uh, some, yeah. but I really like fixed glass. Especially if you got heating and air, of course, and mini split in your house. And if you got a couple windows that'll open and close, up high windows are great. Especially yeah. if you've got a bedroom up there sure. and you got a beautiful view or That's something in I the say. woods, it's really nice to have okay. a fixed glass. And this is what, I don't know if you mentioned, this is a craftsman. This is a craftsman, our mm -hmm. craftsman, and that's a craftsman. So David and Jonathan, is really, they've really taken on the craftsman. We they've probably have, I think we've got about eight more left on our books yep. mm -hmm. to build craftsmen. And explain a craftsman just really quick. Okay, the craftsman is we build right on the trailer. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll, before I get into that, yep. I wanted to show this um, the Browns. This is your house. This is being framed. They're on it right now. Uh, we're waiting on, uh, we got a truck coming up tomorrow. We had to move. Let me show you a little bit about a craftsman. Okay. That I can show you here. Is This is a fender, right? Yes. So the fender, the actual floor inside is here. Okay. So mm -hmm. you can see the fender is inside the house. It is. So it's something you have to contend with mm -hmm. when you're designing the house. Yep. Could you imagine if you have your floor here mm -hmm. and you have a range here or a refrigerator? Right. It has to sit on top of the fender. And because we've kind of not built as many as we used to, this is all we used to build. This is all we used to build. Yep. Well, we have neglected because we get in this routine of not mm -hmm. having to de deal with fenders. We said, uh oh, we have a fender. You can't have a door halfway on a fender and halfway not. That's right. When you build above the floor, mm -hmm. oh my God, you can do anything you want, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we've had to actually 
This is uh, the living room area, and we had a 36-inch door. We had to move the door because okay. it was over a fender, mm -hmm. and you don't want to step on a fender and down. Some yes. people don't care. Now, yeah, we've had uh, probably a two houses that I remember that they would step down. They, that's yeah. what they wanted. Exactly. So, but this he didn't. And if we had a 36-inch door, oh, the tub shower. This is a tub shower. Mm -hmm. The tub shower wouldn't fit in here. It's five feet, and you what have to have mean, five a tub foot. Shower in the 18 foot. Yes. Wow. Eight by eighteen. Okay, they wanted a tub. So they're got a tub shower going in here. Mm -hmm. That's the plumbing for it right here. Mm -hmm. Well, if you had a thirty-six inch door, you can't get a thirty-six inch door here. No. So now we got the tub shower. It's on order. It's coming. It's coming in tomorrow morning. Okay. They can't finish this because this stud's going to come out. Mm -hmm. So they get the tub in, I see. and then they'll put it back on. Okay. Okay. So there's just sometimes and listen. Tub showers, windows. Do you know we're ordering windows 16 weeks out? Yes, sir. I do know that. So, uh, so there's fixed glass on each end. There is. And I walked through the, I was do. I did, the, I didn't do the design. I did the design, but I mean, I drew it all up and stuff. And remember, you know, we added these windows. That's why it's cheaper to have two windows instead of one big piece of glass. Yeah. But look at that. That mm -hmm. whole wall is glass up there. That whole oh, wall. Yeah. I see that. It's going to be beautiful. That's nice. Yep. Okay. So that's the reasoning in here. And of course, like Amanda There's said, the big fender. Amanda wanted to know what is a craftsman different than anybody else yep. is the fenders are inside the house mm -hmm. and it gives you more vertical space. So we actually almost built like, look here, here's the, here's the frame mm -hmm. and you can see our plywood is on the frame. Mm -hmm. Now inside here, we run wood inside. So you don't have that bridging of cold weather yes. and um, of the cold steel hitting the subfloor mm -hmm. except for right along this perimeter and our siding goes over this we insulate the floor okay but it gives you a vertical of about 11 foot i mean look how much space is up to 11 foot four vertical space in here and this is all we used to do we built hundreds of these types of homes yeah and um okay so it's a it's it's a heavier home a bigger home. You can see the a continuous header up here, mm -hmm. which we like doing. Is that going to be glass? And I don't think so. Okay. It may be. I don't have the blueprint on me here. Okay. It'd be nice to have a little hopper window it right there. It would be or it? something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, all, right. all right. Good. And then the other one's a Yeah. We'll call yeah. It. And the boys are over there. So that was, so that's yeah. the two, one and two. So we've got fine. Fine we, and brown. What size is fine? I don't know. It's a big one. You always ask me questions. I know. I why know. didn't I, you, I know you just All these numbers and names and stuff. I, I just know, can't keep track names. of 14,000 homes up here, Amanda. Ah, what's my name? Quick, quick, quick. Yeah, you quick. Uh, uh, it's uh, going to trouble. Okay. Oh, well, okay. I'll take that. <laughs> okay. All right. Bye. One and two down. We're going to. All right. 